Okay, hello everyone. Um, today I was thinking that we should uh, take a closer look at the patterns I have, the PDF patterns I own. Uh, it's mainly um, Heaven Earth designs. Uh, you would know that if you follow me. But uh, let's over to head over to my drive. And let's see. Um, first of all, I have all the patterns for the Mythical Creatures Cell 2020 uh, by Pain Free uh, Crafts. That was just an awesome cell. I didn't get too far. I got to the... I think F, but I will be working more on that when my wheel will choose that. Anyway, so I have the complete alphabet there and you can do them separately. They're just so cool. And then I have a map with mixed patterns. So I have, yeah, the pandemic, which was a free chart um, via Sarsi Girl, I think, on Instagram. Uh, all you had to do was to donate something for animals, which I did. And then, um, got a little bit of a free patterns I think farewell Junkolas that's from pain free crafts the forest century is also from pain free crafts I think yeah and then I have my game of thrones and the halloween cast is Anina. they will release the pattern first part here in the middle of September and then I have like Hogwarts in a bottle. I would really like to start that one. And the key to love, that's a free pattern. The koala bushfires, uh, you got the patterns uh, when the big fires were going in Australia. So you bought them via Etsy and the money was donated uh, to the koala bears, I think there, or the fires. And then I bought that one like a cherry blossom. I don't remember, but it's from Etsy. I don't remember the seller. And then we have the Lost Lorian Farewell. That's also pain-free crafts. Uh, you have that artist now on um, Heaven and Earth as well. Uh, Lost Lorian Farewell was my first pain-free crafts pattern. And then the Outlander Vows was gifted to me. And then we have the Pandemic, uh, Long Dog Samplers Pandemic. Oh, and Raven from Tilton Crafts. I love that one. Uh, I think there's so few uh, cross-stitch patterns with guys uh, which look nice. You know, there's lots of women and ladies and they look beautiful in all kinds of ways. But there's not a lot of guys out there. And Raven, Tilden, first it's a Raven and then he looks pretty nice. Um, strength, I don't remember that one. Letters from Hogwarts, yeah. We know that cell from, is it two years ago? One or two years ago. Shelf Life, of course, from um, Giga Rouge. And my latest edition, The Beauty Will Save the World. It's in the mail. It's coming here soon. It's stuck in customs, I think. Yeah, so that was the mixed. And up here, let's see. I have free patterns from Owl Forest. And now I don't have the Stitch Along uh, Alice in Wonderland. So I will need to head over and get that one. 
and hands across the sea samplers so the heather sampler and the holly jolly uh, were free patterns when we joined the ann morrison style and then i have my jane hearth and one of my favorites the checkerboard house i need to do that one it's so cool now you can't see the pattern but if i if i press the pat the pdf the pattern will open we can try but i will close it if it shows any kind of you know yeah this looks pretty good this is so cool i love this pattern so yeah i could have opened all of them but it's gonna take too long um It's going to take too long. And then I have a map with all my chatelines. So I have. Um, the mystery 19. Which uh, you get in all kinds of uh, shards. Uh, you don't get in, get it in one big PDF. So. And then we have the Outlander, the normal and the special edition. It's not called the Outlander. It's called the Alpine Mandala, I think. But I call it Outlander because that's the edition I'm going to stitch. Um, what do we have here? There's. I don't think there's a picture. So I have the Victorian Garden. I have the framed Russian window, um, which I'm in the process of kitting up myself at the moment. And what else do I have? I have um, yeah, the medieval town Mandela, and then the mini mystery number three. And pomerium and poison garden so i'm sorry it's just boring too it's going to be boring for you guys to look at this but that's the chatelaines i have um yeah and then mostly you know it's heaven and earth designs and here i've organized it so i have the patterns for each of the uh, artists uh, and the list is pretty long but I do have like my favorite artists. So this is a freebie. It's, it's a quick stitch. Can't. Uh, by Cindy Nielsen. Uh, and Thomas Kincaid. Kincaid. I only have the one, the mini uh, central. Uh, mini Central Park in the fall, which I'm starting on the 11th of September, together with the uh, Stitching Moon. And then we have Stephanie Pui Moon Law. And here I have the Jade Hills. I started this on like a huge count. Oh, I don't know if it can. Maybe it was a 14 count Ada. It was huge. I just stitched the top corner. So, but her art is just beautiful. Here's the cathedrals in the forest. Very, very beautiful. I usually get the patterns that caught, caught you know, c catches my eye. This is one of them, dream, dance, fear, and these uh, made me think of um, um, Game of, no, not Game of Thrones, um, Lord of the Rings. The ring, what do you call them? Ring rots, rates? I don't know what you call them in English. And then we have Selena Finish, also just one. I think this was a 
freebie as well. This is not a pattern I think I would have bought myself. Yeah, Sea of Roses. And Scott Gustafsson. It's two of the early patterns I got and I got them because my husband liked them. So, but I've learned to stitch what I like and what no one else likes. So this is Saint Nick in his study. And we have Snow White. I can't zoom in on that one. I don't know why. Uh, maybe. Oh. Okay, let's go. So Sarah Butcher. What do I have from Sarah Butcher? Oh, yeah. I love this one. It is Into the Word. She's sitting, this little cute elf is sitting and reading. It is so pretty. I love this. And Rose Con. Oh, yeah. I like this one as well. I wanted to do this in diamond painting. But so this is the mini Rainbow Dancer Unicorn. I love it. It's so sweet. But cross cut, you know, cross stitching this. No, mm -mm. not with all that background. But as a diamond painting, it would have been beautiful. And why I chose this one is because my daughter, when she was a little bit younger, she loved rainbows and unicorns. So that's all the recharted hates I've put in there, like the old ones. Oh, and then we have Randall Spangler. So here we have a little bit of a collection. <laughs> I love Randall Spangler. Do you want to see all of them? Computer Wizard. Oh, oh my God. And these are just the regular pieces. I mean, imagine these as super sized max colors. Oh my God. Yeah. I would definitely like to <laughs> do that. And then we have the Couch Dragon. This is, you know, the one I'm stitching. I have a whip on it. I'm not stitching on it right now, but I have a whip. Uh, this one is Dream Vision. It is so nice. I just love the dragons here. They are so cute. They're always cute, but sometimes they're more cute. And then we have one of his black and whites, which I just find so mesmerizing i love this chart i would love to restart it i started this on 32 on 32 count and i didn't get far but uh it's so cool there is so much going on in this piece everything tastes better with chocolate chips i was thinking of getting it as a mini I got the regular size and oh, I love it. Just love it. Yeah. I had big plans on starting it. I never did. So we have the kitchen helpers. Oh, I love it. And here I think, yeah, I got the regular size. I thought I would, I didn't go with the mini because I love the detail in the Chinese China there so um, yeah I wanted the the big thing what's next midnight munchies I have this as a whip and it is uh, the color expansion but regular size I just love how the the shadow falls on the watch Oh, why do I have two kitchen helpers? Uh, I guess I have. That happens sometimes. And then we have the mini Sunday Delight. And I have finished. That is one of my finishes. I think it is uh, about two years ago I finished it. 
2019 so it's the one hanging on my wall if you watch my floss tube uh, celestial dream this was um, a rack someone gave me random act of kindness this very sweet I love it it's also a mini oh yeah I want to stitch I want to stitch them all <laughs> want to stitch them all so here we have mini dragon in the morning this is also whip and I've stitched it 30 percent is done already so oh, I love it yeah love 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 uh, the mushroom in large uh, yeah there's larger pieces but I I think it's so cool uh, also wanted to start this but I never did and I don't think I ever will but this is a quick stitch uh, tea party I don't know if this was like a stitch along once or if it was uh, free of charge I don't remember but this is not something I don't like his fairies too much so it's nothing I'm gonna start then we have when this piece was you know a stitch along in 2013 so I finished that is it also hangs uh, on my wall behind me a lot of confetti but I love it so nice I I miss our stitch alongs on heaven and earth you know I wish they would continue I would gladly pay you know the full price to join when they had the sales they were free they don't have to be free um, yeah also one of the later releases reading time I was thinking a mini but I couldn't resist so I got the regular size lots of greens a lot of leaves that's what's holding me back from starting it so here we have some other cells so w when you completed your whole you know the cell picture you decided to join with you had like five choices I think um, and there were uh, four releases so if you finished your piece you got the patterns from all the other uh, choices you could get once you finished and this is a quick stitch of the Halloween house from Randall Spangler so cool and curled up with a good book I think this was um, because if this would have been a cell I would have cho chosen this one so I don't know if it was uh, given for free ones I'm not sure but I think I would rather stitch the whole thing there should be more cells sanctuary of knowledge this was a favorite of mine for very long and now you can get it as super sized and yeah uh, it's not that you need more detail in it but it is so cool you should go and look up the the whip pictures on that my god it's so cool and here we have so many books so little time and I think I have this one as a printed pattern as well um, oh, go watch uh, rocking stitcher oh, yeah, yeah 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 she's almost completed with this it's so cool I love it love it uh, tales of mystery very sweet and we have the train of dreams which is finished and framed and I want to do, do it all over again as a super size with max colors. Yeah, so I'm seriously considering it. Treasure Quest, I have this as a whip. 
love it. Also early buys. Now let's go to Nanny Thomas. This one is, um, what do you call it? Discontinued. So, but I have uh, the Dragon Witch. Very awesome. And I have, this is a cell, Lovers, very pretty. And Wings in Repose. I just find it so powerful and cool. And it makes me think of my grandmother. And then I have Astronasis as well as a printed pattern. Miles Pinkney. We have the Treasure Dragon. It's like, you know, the Hobbit themed. It's so freaking cool. I don't understand why I never started it. I had the kit. Now it is just retired. And the Astronomer. Love, love, love. You know, before this was the piece you should get if you wanted max colors. So it has 120 colors. And most of the others had around 90. But we all know that this is just, you know, not that much colors. Also favorite of mine, Rebirth. I just love this piece. I have never started it. The um, artist is Michelle Lee Filon. Let's go to Michael Hayes. Here we have two. We have Misery, Misere, Misere, well, whatever. Freaking cool. I love the powerful girls in the back. Awesome. And Joan of Arc, of course. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Love it. Yes, Meredith Dillman, also a stitch along. And I have finished this one. It's framed, it's hanging on my wall. And I love it. And it looks so much better as a finished cross stitched piece. Yes. Uh, Melanie Dillon, here's the toil. And I will say, I think it's censored, yes. So I had been away from Haid a while and I went back and I found this one so cool. I thought I was going to start it. I never did. Very cool. Okay. Matt Stewart. Oh, we love Matt Stewart. Here we have Hope Returns. I really want to start this one. That was a mix up with the um, uh, symbols and colors. So when I was going to start it, I realized that was a huge mistake made. So I never started it. They did fix it. But... Um, yeah, I want more detail. Hello, come on, back up. Uh, Dragon Forge started, but retired. Awesome. I love the dwarves in here. So cool. You know, I'm thinking World of Warcraft, you know. The Eternal Promise. I started this in May and it is so beautiful. Very beautiful. And Nikki Crofts has finished this. So go over to her channel and see how it will look finished. It's so beautiful. The gift. I really want to stitch this one. I love it. I love the fall colors. Oh, the flowers and Galadriel. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. But never started. Here's the Lady of the Mirror. I started this one. I think I've stitched about two pages. I want to restart it. So beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, I really want to restart this one. Uh, what else? Of course, the Shield Maiden. My favorite girl. It's Eowyn, of course, because she's a badass girl and she falls in love with Faramir. Unhappy. Unhappy love, you know. Yeah. Whole story short. I love it. Lisa Parker. 
we have one Lisa Parker and that's my favorite the watchman oh I love these I love these birds oh I can't wait to get back to this whip and we have Linda Ravenscroft here we have free flight a quick stitch this is a must be some kind of free uh, freebie of some yeah free it has to be that um, and the quick stitch Jack I just love his face his smile and his eyes never started though and then we have dream of peace I wanted to seriously stitch this one and, you know, become, you know, I'm thinking of me and my daughter never started. And then we have a stitch along. I, this is, I got this pattern for finishing something else. Very cool. And this is blue moon. Laura Prindle. Her horses are just amazing. I got the mini black. So beautiful. You can get this as a diamond painting over at Diamond Arts Club. And we have Fie Fiereza. Fiereza. I don't know what that is. Furious maybe. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Never started. Kai... Kayomi Harai, the blue dragon, started, retired, but his art is very beautiful. His or hers, I don't know if it's a he, him or her. What happened? Something is happening. Maybe it's getting full. Let's head back to drive. And we had some stitch alongs with this. This is Book and Kitty. Very cute. I didn't choose that one. Here we have the Siberian eyes. I remember this one. Look at those eyes. Wow. But I chose other pieces to stitch. Karen Middleton. Where do I, what do I have here? A freebie. Autumn Fairy. Yeah. Nothing I would stitch. Julie Bell Vallejo. Here we have a little bit of a collection as well. We have the Passion for the Future. And as you know, I have this as a whip. Very awesome. Her private garden. Something I would like to start. If I'm finished with Softest Steel, I could start this one. We have the Midnight Watcher. And... This is also a whip of mine. Very awesome, lovely colors. Um, and we have my softest steel. There are more of Vallejo art I would like, but yeah. Jasmine Beckett. Griffit faces fairy. This is my favorite, and I saw this was released as a max color. So if I'm gonna start this one, I will get that pattern instead. I love that one. Ivan Piri uh, never started, but I wanted to start this one. I like the vampire series that was released. Uh, this one I started, and actually I love that too very very much i love her face expression you know like she has just sucked the life out of the man she loves love it and we have ivam piriyuto i don't know she's also a vampire so i wouldn't like to stitch this one but it was more for the collection uh 
and here we have Kali. I like this one a lot. So cool. I love the color, you know, of her skin. And Mini Alice has Snow White. Uh, I got this as a rack as well. So I've stitched like one piece, uh, one page. Uh, yeah, I would like to finish that one, but it's retired as well. James Christiansen. Here we have a place of her own. Oh my God. Yeah, I really want to stitch this, but I can't make up my mind if I should go with the regular size or the max one. Here we have resistant training. I got this one because I just love biking. Uh, you could all, almost say that this was like, uh, what's his name? Oh, I, I forgot now with a B. Oh, it's the same. Here we have the responsible man. I want to start this one as well. Oh, there's so much going on here and it's so cool. And I like the humor, you know, how he just carries everything on his shoulders. Yeah, I can relate to that. Henry Ryland. What do I have? That's a freebie. This is nothing I would stitch. The water nymph. Uh, Helen B. Land, of course. My Deliciosa. Oh my God. So beautiful. I cannot wait until I get to the girl and her dress and oh, her face. Yeah, I need to get back to that. Gordon Fitchett. I love Gordon Fitchett. Here we have the supersized Grandmaster Max Colors. Oh. I need to start this one as well. But first, when I finish the other one, love them. I have started this super sized Grand Monster. Uh, yeah. I need to get back to that one as well. And we have the Senduck, which I started, but retired. I need to use another technique to when I'm stitching that. Frederick William Burton. Yeah. Meeting in the turn stairs. Love it. Mm. The passion in that picture. Donna Gelsinger. What do I have here? It's a cell. Teddy bears. I will never stitch this. But it was a prize for completing the cell. David Penn found. Oh yeah. Oh my God. This was a plan for starting this fall, but it will cost too much. So I'll have to wait for that. It's a super size Max Colors. Waterhole Master. Yeah. There's some of the Dutch ladies that are, that are stitching that one. So Go check them out. This, the, it's, they're called the Stitch Tears, the group. So this is uh, the Grizzly by Dave Bart Hollett. Also freebie, I think. Lovely piece. Ciro Maggetti. Here we have, oh, this was recharted, yeah. Max Colors, uh, regular size. I'm stitching this one gonna be fun to get back to a cell that's the tigers very cool oh they look so cool here's another cell from him the theater our theater of absurd triptych he has great art and the magic Forest super sized max colors. I want to start this one as well. I love the animals. So nice. And we have the North American mammals, which I will start soon. I have all the materials. Oh, look at those eyes of that mountain lion. Let's zoom in. Look at that face. 
how can you not want to stitch this? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. And Darren, the DC stitcher, is also stitching that one. Let's head to Xing Shu Quick. It's a quick stitch. Uh, it was on Heaven and Earth. It was a price or something. I don't remember now. Why? Was it the lottery? The New Year's Eve? It was something that she made especially for Heaven and Earth. Very pretty. I will never stitch it. Charted by Haid. Oh yeah, we have the Middle Earth map. I started it. I retired it. I had everything. Threads. Nice hand dyed fabric. Yeah. Here we have a freebie. Also something I will never stitch. But we collect. Santa brings the tree. I like this. It's kind of old fashioned Christmassy. But I will never stitch it. And here uh, with my name. So this is like a custom design where they have designed my name in different fonts, which I use for signing my embroideries. Let's head over to Bridget Ashwood. Sweet fairy. I will never stitch it. It was a freebie. Who is this? Brakshana Silienska. And this one is something I seriously, seriously want to stitch. She's so beautiful. And I can just imagine all the confetti. Yes, and I hope there is some krennic in her face. Let's head down to, to the... Yeah, there's krennic. And then I'm just going to take a look how much krennic. 4,877 4, stitches. Yeah, that's a bit of krennic there. But it's going to look good. Ash Evans. I love this one. It is so cute. I love his eye, the cat eye. I believe in fairies. Yeah, it's cute. And Stokes, the forest walker. Story keep forest walker. I don't know. Have I actually bought this? Or was it? No, I bought it because the dragon is so cool. Yeah. And let's do Adele Sessler and then save Amy Stewart for last. Healer's Touch. I started this one. It's kind of retired. I'm not sure yet. I love it though. I would really like to stitch it. But you know, starting those pieces with backgrounds, I don't know. Hold True. Beautiful artwork. Black and, you know, the gray, black and white, I, I don't know. I don't think it's really my thing because I started Love Sings with a minstrel voice and I retired it. My Golden Bird, it is so sweet. I love the warm golden brown colors. No words, the passion in this is just, yeah. She has such beautiful art and timeless. I love this one. Again, mother, daughter. Is it a mother? Is it a, I don't know if it's a mother or, a, you know, it looks like a guy. So it has to be a guy, but I know. Uh, I started it, but it's retired because I started it on 32 count and that's, yeah. So. Here we have um, my Amy Stewart collection, who I love. We have the large world travel bookshelf, which I have stitched about eight. I have stitched eight, eight pages on. Really cool. I cannot. Okay, I need to reopen. I think I'm, I'm taking too long here. Um, Amy Stewart, large travel book, yeah, large travel bookshelf, and then we have Priya, 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 
which is cool. Oh, look at the detail. Look at the detail in that background. Oof. And the colors, you know, she's beautiful. What else do we have? The Pirate's Life. Yeah, I really want to start this one too. Oh, I love it. Love, love, love. But, yeah. And then we have the Quick Stitch Spooky uh, House Bookshelf. I'm stitching this and I'm going to stitch on it uh, for Halloween. And we have, of course, Once Upon a Fairy Tale, which I loved, I hated, and now I love. I'm obsessed with this piece. I cannot wait to get back to it. Uh, we have some double ups and we have the amazing Animal Kingdom, super sized max colors. Oh my God. I like it as well. I, I really, I really enjoy this. I started in the bottom right corner just this year, you know. Oh, looking forward to getting back to that. And we have the super sized secret garden. Oh, this is so beautiful. Confetti heavy, I swear to God. The Fantastic Voyage, also a whip. I have this. I have it as a super size, but it's uh, regular colors. It does look pretty dark here, so I don't know how the cross stitching will be, but I'm sure it's going to be just, just amazing. Um, hmm. you know, it's from Pattern Keeper where, when I load back um, progress stuffs and then I send, I always send my patterns to me uh, via email. So I have backups. So that's why I usually, you know, I get them twice and put them here. Anyway, here's the treasure uh, shelf, uh, the treasure hunt bookshelf it's the color expansion uh, but it's a regular size I don't know if I want to stitch this and here is the treasure hunt bookshelf uh, just a regular size and color yeah so I bought that a few times but I think I have the spooky house bookshelves in two cuts why don't I have that now? I had it like like a bigger quick stitch. I don't know why it's it's not here. Anyway, that was all my PDF patterns, and I want more. So uh, yeah, uh, I'm sorry I was running through this a little bit, but I thought I didn't want to uh, make this uh, too long. So, yeah, I hope you found it interesting. If you want to know anything more about the patterns, just um, leave a comment or email me or send me a private message on Instagram and I will get back to you. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.